Hi, this is Laura Jean Fanella at Women's Station Channel, and I'm here to bring you some health and beauty tips. So let's get going. I have my water right here, first of all, so I'm going to have a little bit of water. I drink at least three of these a day. Really good. Okay, so I found a really neat way, if you're an almond butter person, uh, almond butter is so expensive. And when I looked at powdered almond, um, I looked at it, it was just blanched almonds. And I thought, I have blanched almonds at home. I have some almond flour that I use to make my non-simple simple carb snacks that I have in between my meals. It keeps down the carbs because, you know, carbs can high in triglycerides, which is what was happening to me. And there's just blanched almonds in, here, almonds in here. So I took a few tablespoons of this and I put it into a container. And now I put a tablespoon of this into my smoothies instead of a teaspoon of almond butter that I could barely afford to put in there. And I feel the energy from it. So that's one tip. Then this, uh, well actually let me stay with food. I went to a hiking trail today and I forgot to bring these, but these are called Go Squeezies. They're $2.47. If I remember at Winco and Walmart, I'm sorry about that. They're called Go Squeezes. And I get the apple strawberry, so you get two fruits. And that's enough for me. Like just to bring applesauce, I don't really think would be enough, but they really squeeze into, when you have to squeeze fruit down that small, um, you're gonna get quite a bit of fruit in here. So I ordinarily will bring one of these when I'm out. I get fatigue. I don't know if you have an autoimmune disease or you just get fatigue, period, for, for whatever reason. Uh, these are really good to take with you when you're out for the day. Today I use sunflower seeds and homemade um, cheese crackers that I have over at Lori, Lori in the Kitchen at blogspot.com. Big Man's World, he has a really good cracker recipe. All it is really is just a cup of cheese and a cup of almond flour and two tablespoons of um, cold water and just put it into the food processor and then just squish it down in between parchment paper. Not quite as thin as you can do it, but close. And um, just bake it six minutes on each side at 350. I mean, I score them and then put a little toothpick in it and the ends are like funny shape, but I mean, I don't worry about that. For the most part, most of them are square and um, they're so good. So the other thing that I do is I take magnesium, which we get magnesium in our, um, a lot of our multi, multivitamins, but um, to have an extra magnesium with Hashimoto's, which is what I have, it's um, an autoimmune disease, um, it really has been giving me a lot of energy. And all I do is you have to be careful how much you take. Um, this is 250 milligrams, so I get about 110 in my regular vitamin and then 250 here. I think it's about 360 or something that, that's good for a female to take. I went and researched it online. So mine is like right on what you would need. So this does give you a lot of energy. So for me, it's good. And hopefully if you have any kind of autoimmune disease, you have fatigue easier to be okay. But what I do is if I'm, if I'm questioning whether or not I should take something that someone else takes, I just check to make sure um, that the amount that you can take is not over what I'm thinking of taking. And then I will put in like Hashimoto's, um, like what's harmful. If it's a particular vitamin or food, I'm not sure. I'll put in harmful effects of this particular food. If you have Hashimoto's, harmful effects of this particular vitamin. Um, if you have Hashimoto's, and I always find out what I need to find out. Now my alg algorithm, because I was in college doing a lot of research, I get some really good sites. But if you do like, um, uh, it's not college cited. You just type in college cited sites um, before and you'll get the proper name. But you'll start to get really good algorithms. Like I get a lot of um, Healthline and WebMD, and now I actually get like a lot of like hospitals and um, school peer reviewed and medical peer reviewed, and um, I just get a lot of different really really good information on stuff. This is a really cool thing that I have now. This is just a simple five dollar fade cream from Palmer's Skin Success. Now I don't know if you have any kind of spots 
that you've noticed coming up in your hands, other sunspots, age spots. I mean, you could have had some kind of um, uh, illness that caused your skin to change a little bit. Let me tell you, this stuff really works. And like there's a little bit of A in here, vitamin A kind of um, derivative. And I wasn't really crazy using that on my hands because I feel like it'll be drying. I used vitamin A for years from acne growing up and then it ended up being a beauty tool. And then I got away from that after I had my son, which I'm glad I did because I think that's really drying. But I'm telling you, it works. I mean, I had like some spots coming in and like I wasn't always really good in the sun putting on hand cream and I said, oh shoot. You can almost see like a silicone sheet of, you know, like the spots coming up and I started getting really nervous. Well, I searched online at Amazon and this woman was sweet and kind enough to say, look, you know, ladies, get this stuff because let me tell you, it'll come on, it'll just come on you, you know, to the point where, you know, it's hard to do anything about it. But um, this stuff will fade in the purity habit, so don't worry about that. Um, you're not going to lose with this, so I'll put the link in that below. Another beauty, okay, now I can't say enough about this silly little thing, okay, because women, and I still have my little thing, little like things sticking out. I have a lot of, and I'm not trying to put in an excuse, I have a lot of injuries from abuse, so I've had my muscle torn here, so my face like will hang more over here, and then um, like I can feel the soreness of muscles, you know, that were, were ripped and they still hurt. So I do have kind of a separation a little bit of where all my injuries happen. But um, all in all, we have a hard time trying to keep, you know, that nice neckline. And um, like I can feel the soreness now. I can push down on it. It's like, it's like the fat will sit there and deposit in this one area because there's nowhere for it to go. And I have that in my arms too. But um, this thing really works kind of it will, it will get rid of a lot of the um, the really hard stuff that's hard for us to get rid of. and Because we'll look really pretty straight on and you know when you get older and then you have to turn to the side and it's like, oh man, like it's a lot harder to, to get the muscles. Like I, I did base exercises, but then I get tired because my head injuries that were worse from abuse, um, well always from abuse, that worse from, from being hit <laughs> really um, would hurt me a lot and sometimes I'm even careful how much I use this the, the stress that I'm putting on my my chin and my, my face it feels really good on my chin though because it's like my body wants me to fight and, and fight to get those muscles back under my face but all you do is you take this thing oh I'm covering my microphone I'm sorry uh, let me try to do that better you take this thing and then you just go you keep your mouth straight You do that for about 10 times, and then you do it again with your mouth open. I don't know if I want to do that. All right, I will. Okay, 10 more 10. That one looked prettier. <laughs> and so I'll do that for um, four sets. Four sets of my mouth closed and four sets of my mouth open. And I always keep in the, um, the weakest wire in here. I don't even know how you open this up. I'm sure it's an easy way. But they sent me... Um, three other ones, but I don't really want to push my face too much. This is called my facelift. I got it from like Shop HQ online, but I've seen them around too. I'm going to um, see if I can find the link still. I think they still have it over there. So obviously you need the link for it, but will you have the, the name of it? I think they have it other places. I think it's only 20 or $30. It's worth it. I can definitely see the difference. So, so that is what I want to share with you today. A little bit of beauty and a little bit of health, and it goes a long way, so I hope I was able to share anything that will be useful to you. So thanks for stopping by and listening. Laura G. Fennell, Women's Station Channel.